Alright guys, so it's Sunday, we're back on this little experimental build, what we're doing today. And today I'm just going to put, um, I called them yesterday headers, but I meant roll locks. So, that's what they call them, but I'm only doing half a brick, you see, so. They're going to sit on top like that. Okay, I'm going to put them all the way down here. And there's going to be two angled cuts here and here. So we'll see how that looks, guys. First of all, I'm just going to get some cuts made. I'm going to cut them perfectly in half. You can see there, I made two cuts. I'll just snap the back and trim it. But there's, that's a perfect width of a brick, which is around 102.5 mil, to be exact. Now, I know some of you brickies out there are thinking, is that all you've got? Well, don't forget we're only in winter, guys, so we're just playing around with things. You wait till summer comes, I'll be building some proper stuff then. You know, some proper stuff. Some nine inch stuff and some proper feature walls. It's just, you can't really do it in the weather because building things like this, just, you come out on the spur of the day, sun, sun's out, you've got a few hours of filming to do, and that's all I've got. So, don't just think this is all I've got in my locker. Right guys, just as a quick note, as you'll see here, every three row locks is the width of a brick, or the length of a brick, so, one, two, three, to a brick. Well, I've just built these here and I forgot to press record, sorry. So, as you can see, we've just built these three row locks here across this stretcher and these three row locks across this stretcher, or this brick. Now we're going to put these in, but first I'm going to need to make the cut here. Okay, and we're just we're going to work work it off this brick. Alright guys, this is my cutting station here. I'm actually using this saw today, this electric saw from Evolution. And I'll tell you what guys, I'm not just saying it because I got it for free, but it's absolutely a brilliant saw. Loads better control on that one. You know, it's, it's, I find it better for doing cuts like this. It's more accurate. So you look at that for a cut, what I mean? Right, I'm just getting this last cut in now. Some of the joints are not filled properly, but when you're moving them around a lot, it's very hard. The main thing is to get it right, and then you can you can always fill it in after. I'll chip that bit there, so that's not good. I'll try and disguise that. Shout out to Ox Tools, who I would love to be sponsored by, but I'm not quite there yet. Hint, hint.
Right then guys, there you have it. That's how you build a bit of a feature, a bit of a practice wall. If you want to have a go at it yourself, have a go with a rake and cut and also we finished it with some raw locks or brick on edge, whichever you want to say. Yeah, like I said, it's winter, just practicing little bits like this. When it gets towards summer, I'm going to be building bigger and better features, really testing my bricklaying skills, all right? So there you have it, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like rating. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will catch you in the next video. Cheers. I can stay like this for